discuss uh, uh, these are the these topics about the Jupyter notebook. So I assume that uh, uh, you have installed the Python in Jupyter Lab or Jupyter notebook. So today uh, our topic of the discussion is this. Uh, first thing is we'll see how to open Jupyter notebook, how to create a folder in the Jupyter notebook, how to create a notebook. Then these two important points, how to access your notebook in the PC, how to locate it and how to open notebook received from the WhatsApp or mail. Suppose you receive some notebook, Jupyter notebook on through the WhatsApp or mail or through the drive. So how to open it into the Jupyter notebook. You see one by one. The so step number one, how to open Jupyter notebook. So we'll run a, uh, suppose we go to open the command prompt so i will use here i will just press window key plus r so this will appear cmd command prompt so i open my command prompt here i will write the notebook so in case of the Jupyter lab, the command will be different. So since I am having the Jupyter notebook, so I am typing the Jupyter notebook and enter. Okay, my command is wrong. Wait some seconds. Jupyter notebook will be okay. So here in my browser, this Jupyter notebook is open. So the next thing is how to create folder and notebook there. So uh, this is the appearance of the Jupyter notebook. I have seen lots of these folders. So later in this video, we'll discuss. Uh, how why this this all the folders are visible here uh, in the Jupyter lab the appearance is a little bit different but you can find the you can correlate it uh, how to open all the things so here in this Jupyter notebook we'll go here new and I will open a folder because I will create a, some folder so when I when I create a folder so untitled folder will be here I will go here okay. and I can give the name of this folder. Okay. So I will choose this folder and I will rename it. Just Here is this folder. Practice Python. So then whatever the file I will make, see, it will be saved here. So in this practice Python folder, I will create a new file. So this is the Python 3 files. I will create the files like this. Okay. So okay. So this file just uh, making a I'm uh, making it a simple program. So just like first program print so I just uh, run this program and just it is a print hello world so <clears throat> now uh, our object is not uh, learning on the python our object is how to handle all these files so just i will make a very simple program now first thing is this how to create a file from this how to save this file so basically by default it is saved here but if you go to the file and go to the download. You will find the uh, you will find the several options. 
you can download it notebook as a notebook as a python or you can also download it like a pdf file so whatever the option you can want to choose you can choose here suppose uh, i want as a pdf file so i choose the pdf file here Here. Again, I will try. Oh, I'll try the notebook. Okay, so maybe some mirror in the uh, PDF format, but here I will download as a notebook, and then you can locate this file. Okay. So here I have not given the name of this file. So one thing that will do, I will give the name of this file here. So let's say a name of this file is first Python program. So this is the name of my program and I'll go here and I can download as a notebook okay so now this program will be saved here um, now this is uh, saved in the download folder i can locate this file here from the download folder and from there uh, you can mail it you can download it you can send to the whatsapp all the things that you can do so that is the one of the thing how to save this file you can directly open this file also okay so you can locate in your download folder so this is the first thing okay uh then the second question is this okay, i will just go back to this folder Okay, so the question is this in the Jupyter notebook, I can see this file is here. I can see my folder here, but where all these files are located in the my PC. So very simple way. Suppose you know the name of your file. One thing you should remember for locating the your file. So our file name is first program. So your first P P R G M that name is given. So remember this name. Then open your C drive. Okay. Go to your PC. Open your C drive. Okay. So here in the C drive, write in your search folder because I don't know where my files are saved. So just I want to locate this thing. So just I type the name of my file. So I will write first. Okay. Um, now you can see here. Okay. It is also showing in the downloads. So I will delete the file from the downloads. In this first program, I will delete file from here. In this file, okay. So you can see this file. I'm seeing this file, and when I'm moving the cursor, it will showing the location. And when you go to the right click, okay. So it is showing this location C users and what is the location of the file is here. So normally location of the file is here. Go to the users and maybe here this is my name. In your computer the name can be different. So you locate the file and now here these are all the folders that I can see here. Okay, When you are here. So all these folders which is here which are also here. Now you can locate your file. 
your folder and the name of the folder we have given practice python and here is the file okay now from here uh, i can also just copy here i can do the copy paste i can move the file here so that thing i can do then so this here i can access all the things here i can create the folder and all the things can be done like normal folders and that will be visible there now one more thing uh, one more question is there and the question is this how to open notebook receive from so suppose uh, someone send you a notebook uh, the uh, jupyter notebook through the mail or through the whatsapp whatever the things are there and now how to open even if you save in your computer it is not visible here it's a very simple logic if you will save your file somewhere here so there you can easily access it suppose for example i have this file okay so name of this file is python weekend demo session so that is um, one of the file now i want to see this file so i just okay i will just copy this file and i will paste this file anywhere here because i will paste this file in this folder okay i will paste the file here so python weekend demo session 2 so when i when i paste the file here i'm now when i go here in my jupyter notebook okay again my practice python so here the file is visible python weekend then when i click okay so now this file is visible here so i can if I, even i want to do any kind of the add you want to add some files so i can do whatever the things i want to do i can do with this files so i can add some more commands more things so this all the things are visible here in this file so this is the way uh, you can open some notebook file uh, the main motto of uh, this video is this last two point to discuss last two point so how to access your notebook in your pc whatever notebook you make this is the way to go to the your c drive and in your normal in a user and if you are if you are finding difficulty or not get your file here so you just type the name of your um, python file here so you can also access through the here you can locate once you got the right location then you can access and same thing the next uh, last point how to open notebook receive from the whatsapp or mail so after the downloading and from the your download folder you can copy here either even you can also do this thing normally when you download from the mail so files are downloaded in the download folder so when you are seeing here if you see so normally download folder is also here so you can also without copy pasting you can also access all the files in the download folder so any file is saved here in the download folder can be open through the here also so this is all the things